Hello friends, welcome to Code Crush Coding. In this video, we are going to learn how to swap two integers without using a temporary variable. So we have already covered the concept in which we were swapping the two numbers using a temporary variable. So I have provided the link in the description. You can watch that video. So this was the logic behind swapping the two numbers using a temporary variable. So we introduce one temporary variable and we store the value of first number or x in that temporary variable. Then we are assigning the value of second number y to that first variable which is x and then we are assigning the temporary value to the variable y. Now what we are going to do, we are not going to use the temporary variable. So we will just have two numbers here int x is having the value 10, int y having the value 20. Then we will print the values of both the numbers and then we will introduce the logic to swap the two numbers without using a temporary variable. So here for the temporary variable we have three steps in which we were swapping the numbers. So in similar way we will introduce three new steps to swap two numbers without having a temporary variable. So what will be the logic for swapping these two numbers. So our first number is 10 and second number is having the value 20. So the first thing we need to do is first x is equal to x plus y. So consider this as x and this as y. x is having 10 and y is having 20. So we will say x is equal to x plus y. So what will be the value of x now? It will be addition of x plus y. So x will contain the value 30 now and y will be 20. Now in the second step we will say y is equal to x minus y. So as in the x we have added the two values x plus y. Now y will have the value x minus y. So basically y will get the value of x now. If we say y is equal to 20 then we will now introduce y to x minus y. So x is having 30. So 30 minus 20 will be 10. x will be 30 only. y will have the value now 10. Now y is already swapped to value of x. So x was having the value 10. Now y is having the value 10. Now we need to just update the value of y here. So the third step is to have the value x is equal to x minus y. So currently x is having 30 and y is having 10. So 30 minus 10 will be 20. So x will be updated to 20. Now you can see x is also swapped to value of y. Here we are getting 20. Earlier we have the value of y as 20. So using these three steps you can swap the values of two numbers. So let's see in the code and implement these three steps now. So here first thing we need to say is x is equal to x plus y. So what will this do? This will add two numbers to the value x. So 10 plus 20 x will have the value now 30. Now we will update the value of y to x minus y because x is containing now the addition of both the numbers. Now we will minus y from it to get the value of x inside the y and the third step is to have the value updated for x. So how to do that with the help of x minus y. Now if I try to run this code here you can see the output x was having the value 10 then y was having value 20. Now we have updated x to 20 and y to 10. So if in any interview the interviewer asks you to swap the two numbers then you can provide the solution with the help of temporary variable as well as not using any temporary variable with the help of these three steps. So I hope you understand how to swap two numbers without using a temporary variable and with the help of these three programming statement. So that's it in this video we will cover another coding questions in next video. Thank you for watching.